Hello, Warfighters, Warrior Cell. Welcome to a brand new episode of Crusader Kings 3. We are continuing on with our move to try and conquer the Middle East. We just have been destroying things as of late. Crusade was phenomenal, took Rome, couldn't be happier about how that went, and I'm just going to keep working my way through here. But the problem is, I've got some big names around here that I've just... I'm, I'm going to have to try and squash. I can't think of... Uh, Pratahara here, trying to go up against them just for these few territories here because, yeah, 70-80. There's no chance whatsoever I'm going to go against these guys, especially when they've got a couple truces. Uh, I mean, that guy's a small potato, but, you know, it just adds how many... Yeah, that guy's small potato, too. Um, but it just adds how many people I have to go up against. And since they're not at war with anybody right now, let's, uh, again... Not going to be helpful for me at all. So I, I kind of have to stop my conquest here for uh, this part of the Arabian Peninsula, at least for now. The one thing that I've got going for me is their ruler is 82 years old. So when he ends up uh, tipping the bucket, he's got a few people who he might have to spread his, his empire between. Let's hope that happens pretty quick. Uh, as far as what I've got going in Africa, there's a few things that I could start doing. I mean, heck, I can move you know, into Medina and everything right here. Um, these guys, 1774, losing a ton of prestige. Uh, right here, 1258. I mean, they've got a, a few alliances too. Ah, crap. Actually, look at the alliances that, that these guys have. Like, if I go to war with them, let's just say I were to go to, for... Uh, this here. By the way, thank you guys in the comments for pointing this out to me. That I could go ahead and I could change what I want to take. Like, if I wanted to just take Mecca right here, I'm going to go up against 31, 34, which I probably could win that one, but I don't want to risk it right now. So, yeah. Also, big thanks uh, in the comment section, too. I've had some people saying that they're loving this, they're watching it daily fantastic i also had somebody mention that even though uh he is arabic he is loving the fact that i am slaughtering the names of everything in here so that made me feel a lot better i put in the comment section like sometimes i feel really self-conscious as i'm going through and playing this game like you know knowing that that dakar right here could totally not be the pronunciation um but hey it's cool thanks thanks for the positivity guys like legit thank you Okay, so getting to everything here. Issues, we've got low county control in Mandab, and let's take a look at what we've got on... Oh. She's still... Um, this guy, for a favor? For a hook? Nope. For money? Nope. Here's where I'm... I could be a little bit of a jerk. 100 gold, that's quite a bit. And then... Uh, I don't even know who that is, so I don't really care. Let's take a look at what I've got actually in my prison. Uh, so I've got some Christians. Let's be brutal, guys. Who Who is this guy? Is he like... Oh, okay. Vassal in the Papacy. Cool. Uh, who's this guy? Captain Giselberto of Black Band. Hey, thanks for coming to play, man. These guys have been in prison for eight years. This guy, eh, he doesn't mean anything. The thing is, is like, if I were to try to, to ransom these guys, like right here, ransom, I can't even do it. The only thing I can do is like negotiate a release, which will might, it might give me a hook. When am I going to use that hook against these guys? Let's, you know. Thanks, thanks for playing. What else do I got? Um, now, some of these other people... Hey, th this person's been in prison. You know, she's been here for 39 years. I totally forgot about her, which is terrible. She likes me, too. Plus 30. How? I forget about her in prison, and she likes me. Must be a major introvert. I can relate. 
Okay, what else do we got here? Let's let's start moving in. We're gonna take a few more of these smaller territories. Where are these guys at? Oh, they're over there. Okay, yeah, because we have a lot of potential over here. Uh, these guys, I would just love to try and take them pretty quickly. But when I look at what they've got for for the size of of their military, not that big, but again, a lot of alliances. Hmm. Can I squash those guys yet? No, I still got my treaty or my truce with them. Okay, let's just let's just move a little bit at a time. Um, another great bit of advice was changing the rally point. So let's go rally point green. We're gonna set that. We're gonna raise everybody here in just a little bit. Okay, so let's. Just make sure nothing else. Oh, I can negotiate an alliance with Prince Ziad, who is my son. Cool. Isra Ziadid can marry. Let's see. We're going to go uh, matrilineal. Who is the... Oh. Actually, let's take a look at my council here. This is a good idea. I don't know why I didn't think of this earlier. Okay, I need somebody with better learning. Okay, so let's let's sort by learning. Yeah, it's this guy's 63 though. Pfft. No. 52, 39. She's how old? 16. Ugh. 36, 33. Okay. He's what? Fickle, generous, diligent. Okay. Let's go ahead and try to see if we can get that marriage to work. And then I'm just going to poot this guy out of his position. Greetings. Marvelous news. Appoint somebody new. Huh? My chancellor has, has 34? W what am I doing there? Hold on. Let's take a look. Chancellor, when it comes to... Oh, let's see. He's the best over there. Dang it. I should have had her marry somebody who's ridiculously good with uh, diplomacy. I think that's what I'll do next. Okay. Anyway, I'm punting this guy out. Um, what was the next person? 34, 18... Uh Okay, let's 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 find Okay, 16. There she is. Accept your marriage purple. Okay. Who? All right, so I'm going to now do this. There you go, Azam. Uh, yeah, you're fired from the council. I'm cool with that. I need to give him a title at some point. I'm sure that's going to come in handy later. Um, Nope. I'm, I'm coming for her, though. You better believe I'm coming for her here in a bit. Okay. Declare war. Going to conquer the county. Third, wait, hold on. How do they have... 1303, just with this one territory. Oh, ally. Gotcha. Okay, that's fine by me. Let's go ahead. We're going to go to green, and we're going to raise all here. Hi, guys. Just move over here. Quick war. It will be done and over with. Who does this guy think he is, anyway? Now, at some point, I can start assaulting the fort. I've noticed when I do that, though, like, yes, that does reduce the time immensely that it takes for me to, to take these positions, but casualties are redonkulously high. All right, enforce demands, easy war. So be it. Empty council position. Investments in Mandav. My lord, it has come to my attention that there's a rare opportunity to invest in the sheikdom 
of Mandab. My wife, Shrim, draws up the details for the business investment, and it does indeed look as if the deal could benefit Mandab greatly if successful. It's a risk worth taking. Um, let's try it. I'm going to get development growth and additional taxes. So let's go. How did my... How did my marshal die? Man, that guy was, was rocking too. I wonder if uh, he was involved in that fight in some way. Okay. Not cool, but... Oh, who are these guys? Oh, you. I was going to take you guys next. Now you're sitting here, causing some problems. And I have to beat you now, too. How old is this kid? How old is he? He's six? Here's another war one. Do you guys want to keep going with this? We can keep going. Ransom. I'm willing to release from my care, but freedom does not come free. I'm going to decline. I'm coming for you. All right, we're going to disband the army. Like I said, a few quick wars. Thanks again, guys. That, that is actually super helpful. Um, let's go ahead and take these guys now. I just got to be careful because I've got, you know, a lot of, of territories. That if I do go ahead and move into, like, really quick, we're going to see them just genuinely be not happy with me. Council... Okay, start working on Dakar. It's going to take nine years. Dang, dude. Okay. This shouldn't be that tough to take. Same thing with these guys, but I'm going to have to be split between them. Gosh, this is all a mess. Like, part of me just right now wants to bring order to it. Just plain and simple. Hmm. Who do I... Okay. So I can't go to war with them yet, even though... I really want to finish these guys off. Okay. We can do this. Have they fallen apart yet? Is he still alive? He is still alive. He's 84 right now. Um... See, Gondar's got a few a few different territories that I just, I'm just not digging right now. Okay. Conquer County. They're vastly inferior. Heck, I don't even need all of these forces, but we're going to, we're going to do it anyway. There we go. That's another territory. No, I'm not I'm not doing it. I'm proud to see my son no longer as a child. They grow up so fast. Okay, so now that we've got got Shrim Ibn Kawurd of the Ziadid Sultanate, let's go ahead and arrange a marriage for him. Ah, French. I gave him the option he can marry whoever he wants. So let's find a spouse. Somebody who's got ridiculous diplomacy. Genius, patient, trusting, shy. Let's go with this. She's 45. He's 16. I just, I'm just using him right now. Increase the levies. Because, like, what I'm thinking about here. Here, you can have a far... That was, let's see, what did he have? Was it 
Diplomacy. I mean, I could just go over here and do it. Okay. Grant titles. You can have the Sheikdom of Afar. Excellent. I'm glad you accept the marriage proposal. All right, Gondar, you and me, let's do this. What are their... Okay, so they're defending right now. I just want those two territories. Can I do that? Declare war. Okay, so I want that one and... Uh, we'll just go here right now. Unless... Yeah, see, I can't. I can only pick one there. Okay, so we're just going to go county, change objective, just so I've got access across the sea here. Dang it. <laughs> I shouldn't have done that. I should have done it where I normally do. A good Ashari, I am known as a deeply pious man. Surely my devotion to Allah should be good for something in this life too, and not only the next. There are a number of people who would do well to be reminded that I am in God's good graces. My dedication should be shouted from the towers. I have been too lenient with the mosque this year. The Caliph surely appreciates a devout Lord. Shh, I don't care about that guy. Give me the money. It's like the least pious thing. Okay, I've heard rumors of a lost home. Again, securing the trade deals. Wow, 130. We're really racking up the dough here, guys. Hey, man, I'm just cutting you off. That's what I think. Seriously, we're rocking some of these wars. Okay, she's married. Or she's going to be married. What was it I was going to get? Somebody with ridiculous diplomacy? Was that it? Oh, I'm not getting somebody possessed. Hold on. Let me take a look at my council one more time. Cool. Um, I could always use a better steward, too. Yeah, we'll go with that for now. All right. Those vile heretics. It's another religion that's popped up. Thanks. Glad we could do business. Which is actually kind of a jerky thing to say when I'm talking about marriage. All right. 65. Here I go. Oh, are these guys trying to retake it? Yeah, try all you want, man. Let's see what happens here. Off you. Um, just worried about how this is going to go. Yep, they're going to try to retake it too. I'm going to actually split my forces here. So you are going that way. And these guys... We're going to we're going we're gonna to chase them. Um, I'll accept. Where's this happening at? Oh, over there. How many is that? Is that 99? Oh, yeah, though. They should be able to crush him. No problem. You don't need me, but I'll still join anyway. Oh, cool. Okay, we don't have to take their capital. Enforce demands. So be it. Okay, so now I've got that. Oof. See, I could just... I could do this literally all day. Oh, I can't force an end to that war. Disband all. Oops. 
Not until that war ends. There we go. So be it. Okay, these guys have taken out the dudes who I wanted to go up against. Um, 1543 has been released. Haha, -ha, she's once again free. It just it just took time. I wonder if he thinks he was trying to like win some win something over with me there. Who? Okay. <gasps> yes. Okay, he died. So these guys, who the heck are they? 225, declare war. We're going for it. We're going to use a holy war this time. And then red, raise all here. These guys are not really in a position here to to really take me down. So we're just going to work our way up the chain. Who are they at war with right now though? That's that's kind of what I'm curious about. Okay, another lifestyle perk. Going to be better at domestic affairs. That can never be a bad thing, right? Accusations of witchcraft. Let her burn. Awesome. My hook has expired. Okay. Oh, did they take that back or something? Well, they're starting to come over here, it looks like. But they've only got, like, three people, so I'm not too worried. They grow up so fast. My son. Okay, 59%. I just... Hmm. Let's go over here and start grabbing some of their territory. Wait, who the heck is this guy? Some populist uprising, it looks like. Scandalous priest. He's making, uh, he's been making exceptions to important procedures to favor those he personally likes and those who does not. You turn 18 and this happens, man. Wow, 5%. I'm just going to stay silent. I can't kill him right now. One day I will, but not now. Okay, my goal is still the same. All right, are they trying to reform what they had? If so, congratulations, you guys are going down. The voice of reason. Let's try and find a compromise. Ah, dang it. That didn't work well. Yep, he's going to be stuck there. We're going to attack him. Crushed him. Let's take his capital. Yep, keep, keep trying to build up your forces. See what happens. Okay, my vassal Wally Farouk has arrived outside my castle with a grand procession of well-dressed diplomats, Ferris and exotic entertainers. Uh, the fellowship resembles a parade led by Farouk himself. In a booming voice, Farouk announces that he is here to pay homage or homage uh, and that he comes bearing gifts of gold. Such generosity is hard to find in a subject. Farouk's loyalty is truly something to enter or to treasure. Please enter deposit gold on the left. Keep your gold. <laughs> I'm taking the gold. I'm in the middle of a war right now. I, I need the gold. Okay, crushed you. Gonna take your capital, see how you like it. 
You're not going to. Like, I get he's going to try and take some of the other areas, and he can, but there we go. 100. You. I got your son. Enforce demands. So be it. Guys, I did it. Now, he's rebuilding the empire. He's, oof. Maybe I should have tried to take him a while ago, but look what I've done. This this is a huge success right here. I mean, we could just end it right now, and, and I'll get the oil in a while. <laughs> I wish that was a thing, actually. Okay, available perks. Let's keep going. Um, Still want the vassals to like me. That's a lot of territories, though. I got to pass around. First off, let's disband the military. Okay. Who is this guy? I don't like you. Can I murder him? No. Nope. Can I imprison him? Um, I mean, the dude already doesn't like me. He's intimidated by your dreadful reputation, fearing you. He is less likely to oppose you directly. What am I going to do? I'm going to revoke his title. Of that. Um, do I have any other disgruntled vassals? It seems like I do. Huh. See, this is what happens. I give some of these territories to people in my council, not my own family, and they just they just get frustrated. Okay. Prisoners can be ransomed. Let's let's pause it here real quick. Um 25 What else do we got? 10. And 10. So that's 45. I can go on a pilgrimage. I'll probably do that in a bit. Rome will lose land when Vassal dies. Primary way to avoid is high crown authority. Can I do that? I don't have the royal prerogative innovation yet. Okay, grant to my cousin. There you go. You can have that. Um, this territory. Hmm. Do I have other family members? I ah, will give it to my court physician. Cause you're you're rocking it. Um what else do I got? Grant to My son's got stuff already. My grandson. I've got grandsons, that's weird. Okay. I kind of want to get rid of some of these these other territories that I've got. I don't know if it's necessarily it'd be good for me to do. Actually, real quick, while I'm doing this, let's let's get a trade port. Sakura, we'll build up that trade port too. Great. Let's see. Um. Oh, yes, other territories I got to get rid of. Above the domain limit. Nope, I want Mandab. This one I'll give away. To that grandson. And then one more. 
Nope, not Mandab. Ooh. I just don't know which one of these. We'll we'll go we'll give away Muscat to somebody. Is there anybody on my council who needs No, my council set. Family members, family members. Um, I read that as Warbird. What a cool last name that would be. Your last name is Warbird. Grant titles. Okay. What else do I got? Can make some titles. That's going to cost some money. I'm sure I'm going to have to do that at some point. Negotiate alliances with my grandson. With... My grandson. Children lack guardians. Oh, I should have noticed this earlier. My daughter needs somebody. Um, get her going with stewardship. And get him going also with stewardship. Okay. I think what I'll do at the start of the next episode while I'm waiting for things uh, to, to keep going is I think I'm going to go on a pilgrimage since I haven't done that in a while. Nice. Also nice. And thank you for calling me an ally. Thank you, two-year-old, for telling me that you are going to be honored for calling me an ally. You don't know what an ally is. You don't know what honor is. You probably don't even know how to talk. Do they have any territories right now? I don't know. Okay, I accept your ransom offer. Oh. He's over there. Okay. Well, good luck. Whew. We got on to India. That was actually really cool getting over there. Now, 3962. I still don't rival them yet. I can't go toe to toe. The other thing is, is do I really want to? Dang, those are a lot of kingdoms. Take the kingdom of Arabia. Whew. If I do that. That might be my goal at some point, is to take the Kingdom of Arabia. Nuts. This is where we're at. Started off as just this little tiny group. And uh, I feel like I feel like I got to do something here. Okay. Well, maybe we'll go down here. And we'll go after these guys next. Because I'm getting worried about how much territory that they've got. And I don't have that truce with him anymore. So maybe I'll take him down and then start working on these guys. Well, anyway, that's going to be it here for this episode, you guys. I appreciate it. More of Crusader Kings 3 in the future, obviously. Just wow. Every episode, it seems like we're growing quite a bit. I'm loving this. Uh, before I forget, though... Let me go ahead and, and do this. Uh, if you are watching this and you've watched this all the way through, you guys know that I like to have you guys put in a word or something like that to know who's been watching these and you know which, uh, which episodes you have been watching all the way through. So for this episode, uh, let's go with Conquer because these guys have been like a major, major adversary since we started things off, and now I've gotten them. So go ahead and put that in the comment section. Big thanks to you guys for watching, for your positive comments. I really do appreciate that. And then also thanks to everybody at Patreon for supporting me, making this happen. If you want to support me too, just go ahead and take a look in the comment or in the description below and you'll find a link to Patreon. That's the best way to help me and help this channel grow. So thank you for watching, you guys. War is hell. You don't have to worry because Warfighters, I've got your six.